For every touchdown I score, I'm upgrading one player on my 68 overall team. Starting with the most insane touchdown I think I've ever scored. No. <laughs> Wait, we fumbled again. He's going to get the ball back. Wait, he fumbled. Oh my God, pick it up. Holy crap. What just happened? We're going to replace Mason Rudolph for 90 overall Russell Wilson. As we progress through our touchdowns, the upgrades will get better, starting at a 90 overall, working our way up to a gold 99 overall. It's important to know we're playing the Sugar Rush house rules, where every time you get tackled, you fumble. My worst fear, boys. We're starting off on defense. Oh, uh, that's what I don't want to see. We got double me on. Come on. Let's go. I'm going to go for the bomb on the first play, although I honestly don't expect it to work, but we're going to try anyway. Yeah, our, our guys our guys are just not fast enough. Now, we went back and forth, back and forth for several plays, but finally we got our scoring opportunity. Please, Russ, go, Russ, go, Russ, yes! We keep Russ, and we get a 91 overall upgrade. What I didn't tell you is if my opponent scores first, I have to discard our last upgrade. And there's one position that is just screaming out to me to upgrade, and that's obviously wide receiver. We're going to get wide receiver Eric Dickerson. It's because he's got 93 speed. Oh, he's also 6'3", and we know I hate short people. JJ Arkega White side gets demoted and wide receiver eric dickerson takes his place in this house rules game mode you start with all your x factors on so maybe we could just get lucky and lob it up to him on the first possession and that's exactly what we did out of range no one else is there come on boss him let's go it worked first try 6.3 eric dickerson now locked into our team now for our 92 overall upgrade we need to go with a defensive player finally it's time we're gonna go with justin simmons out comes geno stone and in comes justin simmons this game was just an onslaught of double me lobs to the end zone going back and forth back and forth until eventually eric dickerson come on animate animate yes pulls through double me pays off yet again we just locked in justin simmons and i think we need another wide receiver because dickerson's awesome but he's always tired six foot five plastico burris is gonna be joining the team as our 93 overall upgrade dickerson gets demoted and our new wide receiver one is plastico burris this guy starts off with a dot of a corner route and then i just got too comfortable i kept trying to lob it up even though plastico burris was double covered now we make a goal line stop and on the next play we get bailed with a defensive pass interference allowing us to advance advance the ball and maintain possession which on the next play we went to the bomb put it on the money touchdown plexigo burris locked into the team let's go get a 94 overall i think we need another defensive player i'm gonna go strong safety for this one just try to get some more knockout help up top ultimately there's like one player that sticks out to me it's gonna be this redux harrison smith he's six foot two we can put some sort of knockout ko on him out comes dean marlowe and in comes harrison smith i really don't don't want to lose that Harrison Smith because having one capable defender does not make this challenge very easy. My next opponent utilized escape artist just about perfectly and ran with Russell Wilson once and he's just going to scramble literally right away. Ran with Russell Wilson twice. Yeah, he's literally just going to take off and then just completely put me on skates. Tackle, tackle. No, somebody's got to make a tackle, boys. Somebody's got to make a tackle. He's down to the three yard line. No, I'm just going to lob it up. Yes, we have double. <laughs> No, we have double me. What happened? We know he's just going to scramble. I'm run committing to the right because I know he's just going to scramble. Okay, he, he threw the ball. That sucks, but at least I made him throw it for once. Unfortunately, this means out comes Harrison Smith. And back in goes Dean Marlowe. Not to fear because Eric Dickerson double me is here. Can we? Come on, Dickerson. Give me the animation. We didn't fumble either. We're down to the five. We are in great shape. No, he's just going to have... Oh, that hurts. I'm thinking it's time we start to get Plaxico Burris involved. Give me the animation. Plaxico comes down with it. Let's go get our 95 overall. That one was just too easy. This may seem wild, but we're actually going to pick up another quarterback, and there's a distinct reason why I'm making this decision. We're going to go with 95 overall quarterback night train lane. And the reason is not only does he get a skate bar, but he also gets pass lead elite, which means we'll have increased throw power, which completely changes the game for us. So out comes Russell Wilson and in goes Night Train Lane. I can't even begin to describe how important of an upgrade that is at quarterback. I don't want to lose this card. We need to try to make a stop. Thankfully,
Hopefully, he just lobs it up, and we're able to swat the ball down. All right, Plaxico Burris. It's your time to shine, my friend. And boy, oh boy, did Plaxico Burris shine. Let's go. We mossed him, and we get in the end zone. Nitrate lane is locked in. Time for our 96 overall upgrade. We're going back to strong safety, and we're going with one of my favorite players, the Clemson alum, Isaiah Simmons. He's six foot four with 95 speed. Out comes Dean Marlowe again, and in comes Isaiah Simmons. And now's a good time to really put our new quarterback, Night Train Lane, to use. We're just going to take off with quarterback Night Train Lane. And like clockwork on our defensive possession, Isaiah Simmons goes, well, almost crazy. Isaiah Simmons, make a play. Make a play. Oh, man, we were so close. And this is why we upgraded our quarterback. Nope, just take off. Take off, Night Train. Oh, my God, he's got a clear lane. Go, Night Train. Don't fumble. Don't fumble. We're in! Two scrambles with Night Train Lane. And we lock in Isaiah Simmons. We're actually going to go with another strong safety from the Backyard Baller program because he's six foot seven, and his name is Jimmy Graham. So this way, Isaiah Simmons is going to be our user, and Jimmy Graham is going to play over the top. It's really hard to lob a pass over a six foot seven Jimmy Graham. And literally right away, Jimmy Graham already makes a play. Short, but he's not going to catch that. We're going to catch that. I need to go down. I need. That's why I needed to go down. Can someone? please no kids he's gonna get the ball at the 27 now this game mode is insane thankfully we're able to swat down his next pass and then on our next possession we go back to our mvp eric dickerson go dickerson yes 73 yards locking in jimmy graham and the w baby let's go get a 98 overall you know i keep saying moss him here moss him there when i'm talking about double me i mean i think it's only fair that we go get the one true moss and that is of course randy moss plexico getting demoted because in comes the one and only Randy Moss. After scrambling with Night Train Lane on the first play, we end up not giving up too many yards on our next possession and then just try to force feed our new wide receiver. Luckily, he makes a bad read. We have one more opportunity and we go back to the boy, Randy Moss. <laughs> Come on, Moss. Moss him. We mossed him. No touchdown, but we're down to the one. And after making a stop by forcing a fumble on the next defensive possession, let's go, baby. We end up scoring a touchdown, but it's not to who you'd expect. Touchdown. Let's go, man. To our silver tight end. But Randy Moss did most of the work that drive. Now with our 99 overall player, there's one player I want to get. And if you saw my last video, you know exactly why I want to pick up this player. Because last time I was forced to quick sell him. But this time we're going to be adding Cooper Cup to the squad. And if my opponent scores a touchdown before I do, I'm going to have to sell him for 250 coins. Today we're upping the stakes. Moss gets demoted and Cooper Cup gets promoted. And because you know I had to, we put double me on him. Not what I wanted to see here. We're starting on defense. Oh, that's not what you want to see. You have basically 330,000 coins on the line. We need to stop here. We went back and forth. I would swat. He would swat. We were both trying to score touchdowns with double me's, and it was failing for both of us. So I tried to switch things up, and luckily, Coop! it paid off. Yes! Cooper Cup comes down with it. Our Cooper Cup redemption. And if you like this video, you'll also like the video where I opened a pack every time I scored a touchdown. Click it.